What's up everyone, back at you again with another video. All right, yeah, today I'm gonna show you a little hack. I had a hack to give you better internet on your PS4, Xbox One, or whatever streaming device you're trying to get when you can't rely on Wi-Fi. And all you need is an ethernet cable and a TV cable box. That's right, a TV cable box. You don't need a router in the room. If you got a cable box in the room and you got Wi-Fi in the house, this should work for you. And I'm using AT&T, AT&T U-verse. Uh, and I, you know, just discovered it on my own couple days ago like I can tell you how many times it was frustrating trying to play Call of Duty Warzone and just keep on lagging and glitching just because of the Wi-Fi the Wi-Fi on the PS4 at least mine isn't that great the range isn't that great so you know the router is all the way in another room it's just terrible on the PS4 when I'm trying to stream and play online so let me show you what you need to do all right so obviously get to your PS4 take the Ethernet cable plug that up in there you take the other end, take the other end, run that back to the cable box and get some light in over here for you guys. All right, see that? It's on the back of the TV cable box TV cable box all right okay so we're gonna go over to the PS4 and I'm gonna show you the Wi-Fi speeds versus plugging it into the TV box and it's a pretty good difference all right so going into the Wi-Fi on the PS4 uh, I'm going to be hiding the majority of the name you know, you know that's that's personal right you know so uh, but I showed the last two so you guys don't be the inner comments saying, oh this is fake it's fake I'm showing you the last two between the Wi-Fi and the, the LAN uh, so you know like this is legit I'm not and you should know it's legit anyway like you see the youtube channel but anyway yeah all right so testing the connection on wi-fi okay now look at that 688.1 kilobits per second on wi-fi terrible not good right so let's go to the wire connection and i'm gonna show you the difference Now look at that difference, 31.5 megabits per second, 4.2 megabits per second upload. That is a, that's a pretty good difference if you ask me. All right, so hopefully this helped you out. Let me know if it worked for you, put it in the comments. Like I said, this is legit, you know, it worked for me. So hopefully it works for you. Hit that subscribe button and ring that bell so you get notified when I upload. As always, salute to the flag. It's for the love of tech and I'm gonna catch you on the next one. Peace.